Nice sushi boats with the netting. Very nice. Tiller rods, both, all the pieces are here. Sushi rolls, more sushi boats, lot two. box of these little pens attached to them. Lots of checkbooks. Nice and red. These are slips. Oops. <laughs> Stay there. Nice watch. Kodiak. First aid emergency bags. Booster chairs. Excellent shape. Cutting boards. Baskets with braided wire. Very interesting. And this is a plastic mesh so it can go through the dishwasher. All of this lot matches. You can see the pattern right there. Tons of these little bowls. Excellent shape. Water glasses, water pitchers. Here's a lot of assorted odds and ends. Do you need some thermometers? Nice, heavy scrapers. Great for your griddle. Brand new. Open sign, it works. Glow in the dark board, very nice. Cutlery, or sorry, not cutlery, sorry, this would be condiments. Nice trays. Okay, these are brand new in the box. Saki glasses. Beautiful, look at these in the box. We have a full case back here as well of the bigger ones. A lot of assorted dishes. Cups and plasticware. This is a freestanding banner ad. There's the base for it. It's all in this one lot with these other Chinese calendars and posters. Lot 52 is this divider. It's wood, six feet tall, as you can see. Very big, it's about four feet wide. Very nice piece. Are you looking for some trays? Phones with all the separate charges for the phones. Plus we have two separate small USB chargers here. All the cash register rules. Lot 60 is 18 of these teapots. Very nice. Look inside, quite good. Lot 61 is this LG laptop. I've already powered it up. It does power up, but everything is in Chinese, so you know. Lot 63 are these three foam core signboards, great for doing advertisements. As you can see, the sushi on this side, but you can put whatever you want on it. This other side is blank, perfect foam core. Lot 64 is a QC camera system with infrared, as you can see. It has all the quick connect locking system, very nice. And about 50 feet per cable per camera. Horizontal blinds. 
about 66 is all the paper lanterns. Nice serving trays. Good luck, Banks. These are wooden sculptures, very cool. As you can see, there's some big ones too. Lot 70 is this dog holding up business cards or samples or whatever in beautiful shape, as you can see. 72, all the Wi Fi and internet. Here's another one of those fish. Look at the size of this thing. Look at the table for scale. Wonderful detailing. These sculptures, we got sculptures, creations inside these glass boxes. Need some taps. We have two torches here in the box. We have a Ryobi sander, barely even dusty. I think they used it once. Small scale and a slap chop. Nice cinema center, look at this. With the HDMI cabling in great shape. Lot 83, these two coils of hose, some bus bins, two drying racks. Lot 86 is everything on this shelf, plus that basket up top. Lot 87 is this Coleman pressure washer, very nice. Lot 88, this stainless steel table, good heavy unit. Lot 89 is all the stainless steel on the walls right here, behind this, behind this cabinet, coming around to the corner here with this corner piece, as you can see. Lot 90 is the rack. Lot 91 is both of these cabinets on top of that wooden base. Lot 92, the wet floor sign, the three big pieces of anti-fatigue matting, this nice little shag rug, and the small reddish rug. 93 and 94, both these little mobile carts, great for steam cookers, for rice cookers, whatever, nice portable units. Excellent shape. Now we're on to the packaging material. Slot 95, 96, as you can see. Cherry scented urinal pucks. Everybody must have those. Sample cups, trays. Lots 100 and 101, skewers. Lot 102, the smaller skewers, larger soup bowls, takeout containers. Lot 105 is this little corner stainless steel table with the backsplash. If you need it, it's perfect. It's about 18 inches deep by about 2 feet, 28 inches wide. Very nice little piece. Lot 107 and 108, these big fish tanks. And I mean big fish tanks. All the stuff on the bottom shelf, that's including the hoses and all this extra stuff, is going with lot 108. These boxes are empty. It's just the fact that the filters came in both of those. As you can see, 108 has two of them. 107 has one. Lot 109 is a Christmas tree. And they paid 150 bucks for it. And the garland and the other Christmas ornaments that are in here as well. And there's also a small bag of Halloween stuff. If you look in the site, you will see a picture of it in the upright position. It's all there and working. Lot 110 are these two small side children's chairs, booster seats. 111. Front door station, not a garbage thing. This is actually a nice cabinet, very well made. Lots 112 through 115 are these really nice dividers. They're on wheels. Let's pull one out so you can look at it. They roll really nice. Nice glass. Ooh. 
Here's the other ones there. Lot 116 is all this benching. It comes off and goes on really easily. You just lift like this and it pops right off. You put a piece of corrugated wood on there, a notch, easy to install, easy to put back up, just like that. Lot 117 are all these benches. There's quite a few of them, as you can see. Lots 118 and 119. When I was sorting the chairs, I took great care to make sure these two lots, the leather, the black leather seats, do not have tears in them. If you look closely, there are no tears in these seats. So that's lots 118 and 119, both lots of 12. This is lot 121. It does have the worst chair, that one there. That's the only one that looks like this. The rest of them just have small nicks and stuff like that. Here's this lot of chairs with the black leather. Lot 123 are all the freestanding tables, the ones with just legs, as you can see. One, two, three, four, five of those. Lot 124 are the tables with one set of legs, and then they're attached to the wall on the other side. Great if you need space for legs and smaller, tighter booths. There are four of those. 125 is these three small tables. Very nice, simple bases. Lot 126 are these four standalone tables. Maple edging on them. Nice simple bases. There's five of them all together. Lot 127 is all the small tables along here. All separate bases, very nice. Clean, easy to use. This is lot 120, it's a dozen chairs. They, a few of them have tiny nicks in them, you can see. I separated these ones. Still in pretty decent shape though. Lot 128, hot water tea station, very nice. And working. 129, stainless steel side sink for the tea station with the drain already built into it. 130 is this coat. It is working and it's on. 131, working. 132, ice machine, working. 133, rice cooker. 34, very nice table. I might get that myself. Definitely nice. This next section is one great big set, as you can see. All identical pieces, all in amazing shape, dishwasher safe, Lot 168 is this nice stainless steel table with the built-in sink and the taps. <laughs> 73 and 74 is stainless steel shelving. 176. 
177 is all this cleaning materials. 78 the two tubs. 179 the burn. 180 is this two door cooler. Water fittings. 182. All the plastic. Not counting the water fittings. 183. The blue trays. 184. The dish assortments. All these mesh strainers and baskets. 186 is this piece of Metro Rec. 187 is this. Stainless steel container with all contents, including some lock tools. 188 has all of this stuff. There's 190. I'm done in here. 195 is this left hand sink for the dishwasher. Works really good. 196 is the actual dishwasher. Very simple. As you can tell, works perfectly. All automatic feed. And that's including all the chemicals under there. 197 is the right hand tabling. 198 is a nice little stainless steel hand sink. 199 is this really nice stainless steel table with backsplash. Look at that sucker. Good well job on that. Looks really nice with the stainless steel shelves, not galvanized. 200 is this beautiful heavy Burkle slicer. It's a beaut. Hardly looks like it's been used. I know a cheese guy that's going to be looking at this. All these scrubbies. Nice little slicer feeling anything. Huh. Soy sauce dispenser. Rice cooker holders. Three quarter thing of canola oil. Knife rack. Nice knives. Simple. Oh, that's a nice one. A couple sharpeners. Another rice holder. Through the floor is this nice stainless you know, steel table again with the good backsplash. Heavy. Lot 209 is this table. This table, all with stainless steel shells underneath. And both of these overhead cabinets which keep it all together as one big unit. Here's the other side of it here. 210, little toaster oven. Lid will not shut all the way. 211, a drum auger, 25 foot. Here's a little three foot snake if you need one. 212, handy little thing. 230 baker scale. 260, this lot of brooms and the dustpan. 217 is a lot of painted third skids, third and no, all quarter skids, but they're good for using as tonnage racks. 219 recycle bins and that. 222 of those two bins. 24. You can see the bins. Simple, easy to work with, easy to maintain. 227 is this nice plastic skid, very good as a dunnage rack or cart. 228 is this first aid station. Like all first aid stations, you can't open it without everything falling out at you. Uh, 229, nice double sink. 230, a nice single sink with the partition. Lot 231 is in the freezer. All these Metro X, there's 32, 33, they're all individual, 34. All of these Metro racks, 35, 36, 237, and 238, they're all in exceptionally good shape. Very little signs of corrosion. Take a look, they're nice. Lots 239, 240, and 241 are also Metro racks. They have a little more signs of corrosion. They're in the fridge, so they have that telltale sign, but still in good shape. Lot 242 is this cold matic walk-in cooler and freezer. Great big thing, wonderfully tall, you need storage. Here's the fridge section. And then 
I'm going into the freezer. Right now it's cold. As you can see, great walls, very clean. Even the floor, nice steel floor. Lot 243 is a single door glass fridge working. Pair of nice walks, some walking tools. Oh, that's a nice rice cooker. Two door walk in fridge. It was plugged in before, not anymore. Nice hand wash sink. A garbage table. You put your garbage can under there and you sweep it off to the side. Very nice. An MKE fryer. Another one. Nice under table. Salamander. This is all one unit. Nice walk station, multi orifice. Single station, also suitable for a large pot. Then we also have the fire suppression hood, exhaust system, very nice. If you look at it, only this one small area seems to have been used, the rest of it is not bad at all.